We're going to talk Brexit, and I'm sorry if you've heard a lot about it, but <laughs> I have feelings. So, this is called Breakfast Means Breakfast at the May Corbyn Household. <laughs> Mum and Dad are still at it. We're going to have eggs on toast. The eggs are cracked and cold, filling the floor. They keep cracking eggs. They didn't realise breakfast would be so difficult. I wasn't even hungry, actually. <laughs> and they kept insisting that they'll both make me breakfast. I kind of feel cheated into breakfast. I don't really want breakfast. But nevertheless, plans part my parents' lips, crawling down their clothes and padding onto the table. And the eggs are beginning to rise, but they keep cracking eggs. And the plans look at me. They're nodding. They know nothing, but they nestle into the noise of the night. And then the plans throw more eggs, and I have no idea why we're having breakfast at night. Order! screams our cat, looking up in great disappointment as he surfaces from a sea of eggs, watching his tuna steak float away. I will have order, he continues. But Mum and Dad are too busy filling the room with poorly made plans that join the ever-growing ocean of cracked and cold eggs to notice that our cat can talk and has a heightened sense of importance. <laughs> I scoop him up, cradling him to my chest and drying my eyes on his forgiving fur, and then we are covered in cracked and cold eggs. And the cat escapes my arms, and now we have spilled milk to worry about too. And I'm still not hungry, but I wipe the eggs from my eyes and I enter the cat into the Spanish version of Britain's Got Talent while I still have time. And mum and dad are still at it. I still don't want breakfast. 